Nancy Goddess, and I'm your host tonight for Big Beautiful People and Admirers and Friends Who Love Us. And we have two beautiful young ladies here tonight. We have, oh my God, an angel. When you said your name was Heaven, right? Yes. How are you today, good, Heaven? How are you? Nice to meet you. Awesome. This is your first time yes. live on TV, right? Yes. And you are young. Yes, I am. <laughs> I remember when I was your age. Aww. Once upon a time. <laughs> <laughs> and right next to you, we have Amir. How yes, are you, Amir? Hello, how are you? Nice to have nice you to also. Here. How are you doing? Good, thank you. So have you ever done uh, live television before? Never, this is my first time and I'm honored it to be It is here. your first time. Well, audience, you're in for a treat. I mean, we have some Mardi Gras treats today here, some yes. beads. So for you, oh, those of you who didn't come down, but if you did, you'd get free beads from these two beautiful young ladies. I have a couple announcements, which I will let you know later. But I have one question before I begin the show. Mm -hmm. Heaven? Yes. Where are you from? I'm from Brooklyn. Brooklyn, yes. yeah. Are you still Born in school? Born and raised, yes. Really? I go to FIT, Fashion Institute of Technology. I love that school. Yes. Oh, my God. Um, a matter of fact, Kevin Shula has the best fashion shows there. Of course. Yes. It's amazing. It's an amazing school mm -hmm. also with wonderful people. And the models are wonderful. And also you, uh, are you still in school? Yes, I am. I'm a junior right now at FIT as well. Oh, wow. <laughs> That's great. And do you know Kathleen Shula also? Yes. She's I, wonderful, she's wonderful, right? With her. She's Have you ever so modeled sweet. for her? Um, we actually started taking shoots together. Um, I was a model with her. We're still looking forward to working more and getting more shoots to me to, you know, get more experience with her. So she's been great. So How far. long have you been uh, in FIT? Since last semester, so that's like August. I've only been here since August. That's great. Well, what may, what inspired you to go to FIT, may I ask? No, no problem. I've always wanted to go. So I went to my home school, University of Maryland Eastern Shore, so that I knew about the program. So my junior year, I got the opportunity to come to New York City and do go to FIT for one year to get my associate's degree. And I, that was my goal. So I did it. I conquered it. And I'm here. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. I'm super That's happy great. for you. I'm so happy. <laughs> I, mean, I was there a few months ago, and they had a fabulous show. Show. I was invited by Catherine Shul. It was wonderful, and the models were great, and the designers were wonderful. And you don't have to take off your clothes and show a lot of skin to mm -hmm. look mm -hmm. really elegant yes. and sexy. You could still be, you know, conservative in a different mm -hmm. way. You yeah, know, that's like so true. used to wear uh, plaited skirts. Mm -hmm. they're, they're in. Yes. They're nice. Yeah, they're love really it. Nice uh, blouses with it. Yeah. And yourself, Heaven. I love that name. <laughs> <laughs> You're my angel tonight. Oh, I love it. What inspired you to go to FIT? Were you friends before or you met in FIT? We met, we met in FIT. FIT. Oh, yeah. Right. Oh, so you yes. came together. Yeah. Oh, well, I you actually came from Buffalo State College. And I'm also doing a program that's kind of similar to hers. And I'm a senior right now. So I'm, You're a senior? Yes. I graduated in May, so I'm this super excited. May. Yes. What are your plans? Oh, my plans are it's still continuing. It's probably like <laughs> real estate, but also I want to open up a showroom to have different brands and like work with buyers. That's a wonderful yes. idea. Yes. Super I excited. I love it. Well, maybe one day if something ever comes up, and you want to have a fashion show, and some of the ladies would like to come here and show some of your fashions, or if they can't make it here, mm -hmm. you can actually film it and just come here yourself and talk about it, and we can just roll it in. That'd that be great. also can be, unless they want to come in person and model. That can happen, too, because there is another big room where we have performances mm. and uh, singers and dancers. Uh, but the I MP4 is perfect. So whoever's watching the show, if you are a performer and sometimes you can't come on and perform and you just want to come on and Skype in and send us your MP4, we can do that, which is great. Mm -hmm. Tonight we were going to Skype in, but we're doing something else. And Joey's back there. In. But you can call in. People can call in and ask questions. But FIT is great. I see you brought your makeup. Your now, you are uh, Amir. Yes. You are a makeup artist? Yes. 
No, I know I didn't get done today. I says, you know, another day I'll get a treat. Mm -hmm. But you're going to work on uh, her a little bit? Mm-hmm. I'm the model bit. today. I mean, I know you started doing the eyebrow. Yes. You started mm -hmm. doing some so basic we have on her. One on the side. We have to still clean up on the top brow, but we cleaned the bottom. And we also set a base for her eyelid. We're going to do this side. So it's kind of like you can see the comparison. right now. Now, I myself would love to have eyebrows like that. <laughs> How do you get those eyebrows? Is it a special pencil? Well, honestly, you can really use just a pencil. You don't have to have a pomade. A tattoo. Some yeah. Some people tattoo that You don't have to in. do that. And also, a natural treat you could do for yourself is like put castor oil on your brows at night, and it will help grow them Because as well. I really do have very thick eyebrows. Mm. It, it's possible if I get the right pencil. I tried it. I said, let me try it mm -hmm. and compare it. Because I can see now the difference between mm -hmm. her eyebrows. It's clean. And after you, what type of pencil did you use? Because on that side looks really good. What kind of mm -hmm. pencil is this? Well, I used the Anastasia Beverly Hills. And Can I it see has, that? Sure. It has the spoolie on the side, on one end, and then on the other side it's an so angle now, brush. Where do you get the color? Okay, so when you first do it, do you brush the eyebrows with the brush first? Yes. Is that what you do first? Mm -hmm. Okay, so I did something right. I tried that tonight <laughs> on my own. Good. And then this side is where you put the color. Mm-hmm. You kind of and so, can brows. I see your color? So sure. It, so, what type of this, brands do you do you recommend? Because it looks pretty good that color on her. Mm -hmm. You have to make sure it's a good um, color tone for each skin tone. So her brows are like a dark so brown. Actually, I've been doing it wrong. I have one, but it's a pencil. It's not separate. Yeah. Now, you don't is have this to have moist this. or is it powder? It's a pomade. Is it so soft? It's soft. Yes. Ah. So it's kind of like a gel, but it's pomade. It's soft. It's it's like a little gooey. Kinda. Could be, yeah. So it's soft because the one I have is pencil. So you know, pencil's a little bit mm, dry. Yeah, crayon, you could a get little the bit same with pencil. But it, just, it didn't come on as good as that because <laughs> I tried it. I was experimenting to mm -hmm. see if it came out like mm -hmm. hers, and it didn't. So now I know this brush makes a difference, and so does this. Yes. So uh, this is like in any pharmacy or? Oh, um, you can find this in S Sephora or I believe Ulta may have yeah. Anastasia Beverly Hills or off the website. You know, you, everyone shops online now, so it's easier to get that that way and, as and well. And what is that particular eyebrow? Is that just used for eyebrows? Yes. So it's called Dip Brow Pomade, and it's in the color, well, the shade Dark Brown. So for her. Right. So I might mm -hmm. use a light brown because so, I like to use brown. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So and yeah, that's good information color. so that I could maybe get mine like that because I want to <laughs> maybe I could do a tattoo, but it's painful. You don't have to do tattoo. But the eyebrows, once you have really nice eyebrows, mm -hmm. you really don't need makeup, makeup on. You could be natural and just a little lip gloss. Yep. And you could have a natural look and look great once mm -hmm. your eyebrows look fabulous. Yes. Mm -hmm. I, I always agree. notice when somebody has in the eyebrow, I mean, I can see a difference. <laughs> difference. Yeah. There's yeah. such a big difference. difference. I mean, not that you have bad eyebrows, it's but there's a, such a difference in that. Mm -hmm. I love it. Very so if any viewers out there have any questions, <laughs> so you, do you, in your, in your future, see that you're going to be a makeup artist? Yes, that is one thing that I want to pursue. I'm such a... Um, I'm just a very outgoing person. I want to do so much. I want to tackle a lot. I'm very ambitious. So makeup artistry is just one thing. So that you're I experimenting do. Yeah. In, in that, and, mm -hmm. and also I was speaking to you earlier, mm -hmm. and you were saying that you also would like to get into modeling. Yes. So it, it's hand in hand, modeling, and so maybe one day some of the girls, if they make some clothes and they want to mm -hmm. come here, or they make an MP for you, can come here and do that too, Definitely. and make them over for the show. That'd oh, be yes, perfect, that would right? be perfect, right? I'd love to have you come back and do that. Thank you. And the viewers would love it. It's nice to have young blood here. <laughs> <laughs> because there are a lot of people out there that have dreams, so you can fulfill those dreams yes. that you want to do. Right. And you want to look good and dress nice yes. and make clothes and be creative. Mm. It's love great. It. So eyebrows are in. Yes, it's <laughs> definitely in. I love it. It's been for a while now, and I'm like, yeah, the these stages. girls do this. And I've been trying, and I have the wrong pencil. And I, but I do have that brush at the end, yeah. mm -hmm. and the pencil comes with it. But that is much better separate. Good idea. So, Amir, I'm going to make a few announcements to let the um, viewers know. By the sure. way, you know Tuesday, what Tuesday is, Mardi Gras. Yeah. That's why I put these on. Yeah. And Joey brought me some, some beads. Ooh. I don't know, some special beads. It's he had in the back white, beautiful beads. 
but um, I didn't take them because I had so much on. But we had all these Mardi Gras beads, and we figured we'd say happy Mardi Gras for Tuesday, everybody. Happy, happy Mardi Gras. Yes, happy Mardi Gras. <laughs> and love it. the next thing is, everyone has been asking, when is Goddesses going to have the next party? Well, I want to let everybody know. March 16th. We are going to have an event, a really big event. I wish you girls can come to New Jersey, oh. March 16. Yes. That is on a Saturday. Saturday. Yeah. It is a Saturday. It's not a very late party, but it's 9 p.m. to 2 a.m. And it is at the Hilton Hasbrook Heights. Ooh. And the address is 650 Terrace Avenue in Hasbrook, New Jersey. Now. I have Joey's phone number. We can put it up there. You can call him for information. And also, the if somebody remembers online, the Hasbrook Hotel, it's the Hilton, by the way, Hilton Hasbrook Heights Hotel. They can look up the number because most of the time... They can find my number on the website. Okay. And, and also, if you call the 456-9119, uh, they'll hear the message. But it's always good to talk to a person. Mm -hmm. So if nobody answers the phone, just leave a message and someone will call you back. So please, save the date, March 16. We're having a St. Patty's party. I know that Queens people don't always like to go to Jersey. <laughs> but listen, you know, we go to Jersey. We live in Queens. So it's about time. Yeah. People from Queens and Long Island need to go to Jersey. Yep. Maybe Let's have next a party. Time we'll be in Queens. But, <laughs> so we're ha and it's a really nice place. So you can dress in queen, you know, like a queen if you want, a diva, <laughs> as long as you dress to yeah, put dress. Crown. Put the crown on. <laughs> yeah, you can wear a crown. And by the way, March 16 is a few days away from my birthday, so I'm celebrating all March birthdays. So everybody who was born in March, come down and celebrate your birthday. Tell all your friends. Yes. Bring a cake if you want to bring your own cake. People are particular. Bring yeah. your own cake. <laughs> celebrate your birthday. It's a beautiful room. Um, it is a cash bar, by the way, and um, the rooms are going fast. It is, there is a, it is a hotel. The rooms are going very fast, <laughs> but it's only until two in the morning, so yeah. it's not that bad. It's not too late. So remember, save that date, March 16th, and check the website out because Joey's number is on there, and you could leave a message, and he will call you back. Or you can call the phone number that's on the website. And matter of fact, it's up there, goddessbbw.com. Uh, the phone numbers are up there. And also the phone numbers of the hotel, March 16, please. I really want to see everybody out there. I haven't seen, I mean, goddesses for a long time. There's been so many. You weren't even born when goddesses was born. Oh. In the 80s. What year were you born? 96. <laughs> 1996. Yes. Well, Goddesses was born in 1984. Oh, wow. So, that's what I'm saying. Yes. So, it was size acceptance when I first started, just to let people know that it is okay to be who you are, no matter what size you are. So, this party is to celebrate life and to love yourself, no matter uh. what size you are. And Tomorrow is not promise, so mm -hmm. we should all love and help each other. Oh, that's so sweet. And um, I also want to say special thanks to all my friends out there that's always helped me. My goodness, there's so many to even mention. And a shout out to uh, Sonia, who's celebrating uh, her life and living it the best way. She's having an event uh, with uh, DJ Lady Wells, April 13. So if anybody knows Sonia or DJ Lady Wells, you can contact her on Facebook somewhere. So shout out to Sonia. And good Sonya. luck. I'm going to try to make that. <laughs> and um, also, um, there's also another special person, uh, Rakia Curves. Mm -hmm. uh, she uh, also has been helping out. She was on the show. Uh, special events uh, that she does. She lists events for people. Um, so if you contact her, a shapely events. 
She will list your event, what's wow. going on. She's great. So Rocky Curves. She has yes. great t-shirts. Yeah. Oh, I want one. Yeah. Rocky <laughs> Curves. Yes. Yeah, I love you have to. Yes. You do? You, you like that? Yes. Oh, my God. So I'm hoping she comes to the event because we are looking for vendors to come. So if she shows up. That would be great. Yeah. Absolutely. Is it Women History Month? Mm -hmm. So, yeah. Yes. I yes. might have the St. Patty's Day. That's Ooh. why I'm ready. Yes. Yeah, I'm ready oh, you look Patty. great on it. <laughs> yeah, for the party. Um, but can't figure out what to wear for St. Patty's. I have to think about it. Your birthday suit. My birthday suit. <laughs> yes, I would have to wear a When I was born, they didn't invent pampers. Oh. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> Seriously, now. Oh my goodness. No. Yeah. No. But no. There's so many, so many things um, that uh, we can talk about. So, ladies, are you gonna you're gonna continue and explain what you're doing to her? You're gonna yes. finish your makeup, okay. and you can talk at the same time as you're doing it. Definitely. And please, call us. Call in. We are looking for people who would like to come and have makeovers. <laughs> by Amir. Yes. Um, she will do makeovers for you if you have a party to go to and you're not a person that really likes to wear makeup. She can do the natural look, natural. I'm sure. Yes. So you're going to continue to finish her yes. makeup? Oh, goodness. <laughs> and, um, my goodness. Okay, so here on this Are side there any clean. DJs out this there? Side. I am looking for a couple of DJs. So if there are some DJs out there, because I'm looking for DJs to um, play for future events, and also some live entertainment, definitely. And hello, Paul Vincent and Filthy Rich. Ooh. You need to come to one of our events and play guitar and drums. Was trying to get in touch with you guys. Hope you're watching. So yeah, so we're looking for live entertainment. So if anybody's watching and um, you cater to a mixed group of all ages, of course, because these young ladies are in their 20s. Yes. So that means we would have to start young, young. from every. <laughs> I bet you you haven't heard of some of the music from the 70s and 80s, huh? <laughs> no, but, probably. Uh, it's good music. The 90s, there's a lot of good music in the love 80s. Love the 90s, yes. Yeah, there's good music in the 90s. I, I love that music from the 90s. Uh, now the music is a little bit different, but. Um, I've gotten used to it. <laughs> it's a lot different. What's your yeah, name? I've got, yeah, well, I'm not going to tell you what year I was born. <laughs> but I enjoy it. And um, this, like I said, so many people out there. So if you want to call in. By the way, viewers, what would you like to see on Goddesses once a month? So call in if you have any ideas for next month. Um, there's a lot of... Uh, people who uh, are lonely and would like to meet someone. Mm -hmm. uh, last month we talked about love and romance <laughs> and people meeting and we talked about what their fantasies were. Ooh. And we had a lot of phone calls when we spoke about fantasies. Mm. Oh, and that wow. was amazing, that amazing girls. How was that? And we had so many phone calls because we had lotions and potions on the table. So that goes to show you the mature crowd. <laughs> when they watch it, they love it. But yeah, we're going to have a great party in at the Hilton Hasbrook on March 16th. If so you don't, don't be there, be square. You're going to be there, girls. <laughs> I'm going to be there. Yeah, we're going to have a ball. Yes. Yeah, so It's not a party without heaven. So do, do you both uh, live in Brooklyn? No, I actually live on campus at FIT on 27th and 7th. Uh, do we have a phone call coming in? Hi, is there a phone call coming in? No. I don't know. I heard the calls coming yeah, in, but mm -hmm. I, I don't know what happened. We had phone calls coming in. I don't know what happened. Did the phone ring? A lot. I'll get it. I'll All get right. It. Well, whoever was calling, please call back. Hello. Because uh, Hello? if you have any questions, uh, let me know who you are. Oh, they hung up. Okay. Um, Sean. Sean Byrne. Uh, Dawn. Sean. Sean, if you That's call. That's where the number came from, Sean. Okay, Sean, please call back or whoever just calls so because fun. somebody uh, missed your call. So call back if you so have any questions. Okay. 
um, for any of these young ladies, or if you have any questions about the goddesses' hey. events or <laughs> coming on the show. I will go back to um, also being single. There's a lot of single people, but the event that we're having March the 16th at the Hilton Hasbrook Heights in New Jersey uh, is on the website, and you can see it at goddessbbw.com, the directions. However, we are looking for entertainment for the near future, very soon, more entertainment and DJs, so please contact us. And if you want to call in with questions, you can. We're looking to do something in Queens of uh, all ages, like a 70s and 80s Ooh. and 90s party. That's the theme? I like that theme. Me too. Yes. And, uh, you know, classics. There's a lot of classics that people love. Foxy Prime. And, and I would definitely like to do an open mic night. Oh, oh that's going to be really fun. Uh, do you girls sing? Any of you two oh. sing? Oh. In the shower. <laughs> oh, uh, I lip sing. sing? <laughs> Amir has a better voice than I do. Oh. <laughs> Really? America, Queen America. Uh, Janet on the air. Hi, hi Janet. Janet. Welcome. Hi, Janet. Hi, how are you? Hi. How are you? <laughs> hi, can you hear me? Yes. Um, could you talk a little louder? I'm good, how are you? Can you talk a little louder? I can't hear you. Can you hear me now? You're a little bit on the low side. Can you hear me? Very low. So where are you calling from, Janet? Okay, can you hear me? <laughs> a little bit. Hello? Where are you calling from? Janet, oh, no, where Janet. Are you go? No, but I, I'm trying to hear her. I could hear her a little bit, so that's yeah, why I said light. where she's calling yeah. from. Janet, where are you calling from? Tell her to call back. We got can another caller. Do pet All right, call another? back, Janet. Hello, Sean. we have another caller? Sean. Hello? Hello, Sean. Hello. I guess Sean hung up. No, I just heard him. Sean, speak up. I just heard him. Okay, well, I guess um, they're getting shy because we have these two <laughs> beautiful girls. Sean is not talking. Come on, Sean. Sean, yes, yeah, where you at, honey? <laughs> Sean's not talking, so then we have to say good night. Renee? They're not, he's not talking, uh, or maybe there's some kind of difficult with the audio because yeah, that's not difficulty. coming through. Try to hang up and call back because we're not getting any. Wait, 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 don't hang up yet. We are not hearing you. So, Sean, if you're on the line, don't hang right. up. Try. Right. 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 Hello. Hello. They hung up. They hung up. Okay. Um, could you please try to call back? We just got somebody in the control room. To working fix, on the audio for the to phone. Working on the audio. So please call back right now and we'll be able to speak to you. Okay. So I In love those time. sponges. Yeah. Oh, yes. They're the best. They're, they're so amazing. soft. That one I really like. I never get to find that one. This one is Viral Techniques and it's amazing sponge. It like it lasts. Is that online? Perfect. You can get it online, you can get it at Ulta, you can get it at Target. Oh, yeah, you have a local. Hello. Hello. Hi, what's your name? I'm uh, John, how are you? Hi, John. Hi, Where are you John. calling from? Hi, John. I'm, I'm calling from Florida. Oh, wow, Florida. Florida. How is Florida today? It's a beautiful day. I'm watching you on, on online, streaming live. It, it's wonderful. Oh my goodness. I wish I was in Florida. That yeah. is great. How's we the weather? All, all, I was there last week. All three <laughs> of us wish we were in Florida. <laughs> Well, I'm enjoying the show, and I, uh, I'm glad that you're getting together with some parties. And um, I have a quick question for the ladies. Um, do you find that more men are, are oh, using makeup for events and, and special occasions or even in day-to-day -day life? Yes, definitely. Yes. <laughs> Especially in our culture. Like, we're from FIT, where it's free. Everybody can do whatever they want. They feel comfortable to do that. So we're around a lot of population, whereas, though, everyone can express themselves freely, especially no matter gender or anything like that. There's no barriers. 
Is there is there a good way to for somebody to do makeup so that they don't look like they're made up? So it's a little more on the masculine side just to cover blemishes and things like that? Definitely, definitely you can. Um, me, I first started off like with just doing natural looks and I kind of had a hard time doing more dramatic looks because I would do makeup for my um, modeling team on campus and they're like, okay, you need to make it look pop more because I'll make it look really natural. So there's a lot of things you could do. Um, just YouTube like really helped a lot. Concealer will help cover up blemishes. My face isn't so clear right now, but under this makeup, which is still natural, but with a little glow. But true will still be good and you can still um, come up with a great natural look. You don't have mm -hmm. to look so different, you know? Yes. Well, thank you so much. I'm really enjoying the show. Thank you. Oh, thank you that so much. Is a great, thank you so much. Yes. That's a great question. Definitely. Because, it yeah, is. men. Um, good night. Also, good night. good night. Thank you, Florida, John. Yes. yes. <laughs> men, yeah, that, that was good. That was an excellent Any question. question about men um, wearing makeup, especially on it's TV. Not like like I feel wearing like makeup. Well, you know what? They, I mean, they're wearing makeup, but you know, they want to cover their blemishes. Yes, right. that's so, just like hair extensions. Right. So, you, have you made over gentlemen, you know, for the shows? Because for FIT, they have. Yes. yes. They have the guys, I mean, they're done over also, mm -hmm. so they could look good too. Right. Mm -hmm. You know, everyone is. Definitely. Even I've, on television, the mm -hmm. talk host. I've definitely um, have done some men makeup for shows. I've done it for like just birthday parties, um, different occasions. So a lot of people are like, oh, I like the way you did her face. Can you do mine? Like male, female, doesn't matter. I still do it. And it comes out really good. And they're like so happy. Right. <laughs> so it's, it's perfect. Great. Yeah. Wow. I'm so glad. That's a perfect <laughs> question. Thank you, John. Love it. That was, that was a good one. I hope everybody yes. has fun for Mardi Gras yes. on Tuesday. Are you girls doing anything for Mardi Gras? Uh, hopefully oh. after I'm done with my internship in class, I'll yes. be out. Yes. <laughs> Early. <laughs> well, you're already in the city. That's true. Well, I I'm like ready for my bar, and the next step would be the Green Day. Yes. yes. Yeah. Can't wait. I can't wait myself. Um, because they celebrate, and they celebrate Mardi Gras big time. Uh -huh. I've never been to New Orleans, Amsterdam. We was just but talking about that. one day I want to go, yeah. one day. We were definitely talking about that. Yeah, you were talking about going Earlier, to Earlier, yeah. We was like, oh, we should take a trip. Oh, wow. This is fun. It's a lot of fun, I heard. Well. Mm -hmm.